Welcome. Today we're going to talk about what unlinked mentions are in Obsidian. I'm going to show you about uh, some ways you can use them and why I don't miss them so much in Craft because Craft doesn't have it and I don't really miss them. Before we do that, there are a few ways you can support the channel. Number one is to become a patron, patreon.com slash curtainsmikhail. Number two is to take one of my courses. Uh, you can go to Skillshare with my affiliate link at curtismichael.ca slash Skillshare. And there uh, you can grab one of my courses. You can all find links to them all below as well. Specifically my Zettelkasten course you'll probably like because it talks about just how to do the whole research thing. That's it. Let's talk about unlinked mentions. So let's start by seeing what they are. We can go over here, and so this is Obsidian right here for me. Uh, and an unlinked mention, what is that? That would be any time where you go into our file panel on the side in here. And so there's our linked mentions and we have unlinked mentions. So this is any time I've used the word shorter, which is the name of this book that I read by Alex Sujum Kim Pang. Uh, I think I reviewed that online, so I will put a note up here. And then uh, anytime I look at that, you can see there's any reference to shorter. Now in this case, it's probably, because it's such a generic name, probably not really an unlinked mention. Um, right, this says it's an unlinked mention, which is weird because it actually says shorter. So in this case, I can link it. And that's actually useful. Well, it's still saying it's an unlinked mention. Ah, because it's in, probably just because of how it's formatted. Shorter. And I could just delete some of these and that'll clear it up. So now it's actually a linked mention like it I thought it should be. So we can still see unlinked mention here. Now what is this good for? There's a few things that this can be good for. Um, so say I didn't have, uh, let me go to Alex's page, Alex Jun Kim Pang wasn't linked but I had mentioned it uh, in some places. I'd used his actual name but I hadn't actually linked it at the time. I could find them all here, I could link them all and that'd be really easy to turn them into linked mentions and then they'd show up in my graph views, stuff like that. So that'd be really good. But honestly, that's it. Um, I've also seen it kind of useful for um, someone who, even normalizing, so you can see COVID-19 is here. Uh, yeah, I've got it in a bunch of spots. And you can see I used the unlinked mentions in shorter to normalize it, right? I had COVID-19 in some spots and then all one word in other spots. And so I could go into COVID-19, find them all, link them, then change the name of the note. And that would actually change all of them across the whole, um, all of my notes. So I've seen that with um, authors in a few spots where we have an author name and we're trying to link all the authors uh, in a research paper. Um, but then we realize we haven't done some of the old ones. So we say start with just their last name because it's unique, like Mikhail being mine. You find all the Mikhails and then you link them all and then you change the Mikhail to Curtis Mikhail. And then, yes, you have Curtis and then linked Curtis Mikhail in some spots, but you still have helped your... Um, Hope you're linking and like linked everything back to the author. So I think that's really good in that respect. Now, some reasons I don't like it is it has to be an exact match. We've kind of talked about that right now. It has to be an exact match. If it's not an exact match, you're just not going to get anything. And that's really not that useful. Um, and that's the big reason I don't like, don't care about it in craft. Um, even if I'm talking about uh, craft, so community, community building, stuff like that. Those are two ideas that might be on the same uh, level, might be the same thing, but if I've referenced it in any way slightly varies from the exact note that I have, then it's just not going to show up. Which makes it not as useful. It's certainly not as useful as some people say where, oh, it's going to show you all these things. I don't think it will, because you will refer to even my example with COVID-19 and then COVID-19. I didn't refer to them as the same thing. And so I still have to go through and do the work to normalize my, the way I talk about things. And that's the big thing I think a lot of people want to avoid. They want to say, oh no, I don't need to do this because I already have all of, um, because my in unlinked mentions will stop my poor data organization. And it won't, it's gonna go with you still. That's it, really. Um, that's why I don't miss them that much. And why I, I just, I don't care if they're in craft or not. And I don't think it's a key feature that I that I need uh, in any of my stuff. So if you liked this video, thumbs up below. If you loved it, you can subscribe, hit the bell. YouTube will let you know what happened. Other ways to support the channel, uh, become a patron, patreon.com slash Curtis McHale. Take one of my courses, you can find the links below, or you can also join me in Discord. 
Um, you can find the link below to that. And I'm usually streaming Fridays at 1 p.m., although my wife was late today, so it's 1.30. Don't have time to stream before my 2 o'clock meeting. Have an awesome day.